Today, I'm gonna to show you how easy it is to change the blades on the DeWalt DW735 thick. What's up everyone, welcome to Make with Jake, a channel dedicated to practical woodworking tips to make you a more productive woodworker. If this is your first time here, welcome. This is going to be part of a series of tips and tricks videos, so be sure to like and subscribe and then click that little notification icon so you don't miss any future videos. The first step to changing the blades on your planer is to unplug it. Because if you don't, and for some reason the planer magically turns on, you won't have hands. Using the built-in T-handle, loosen the four screws on top of the planer and remove the lid. With the lid out of the way, remove the three red bolts that hold the chip hood assembly in place. Store them in the built-in storage tray provided by the thoughtful engineers at DeWalt. Then, using the tabs on the sides of the hood, lift upwards and pull the hood out of the blower. This is a good time to check the hood for any clogs or damaged seals. Using the T-handle, remove all the screws from the cutter head and then use the handy magnets on the back of the tool to remove the chip breaker and old blade. Before installing the new blades, smash the like button. I like to clean everything with mineral spirits to make sure the surfaces are super clean and the blade can sit flat in the cutter head. Don't forget to clean off the packing oil from the new blade before installing. Place the new blade over the dowels in the cutter head. This is what sets this planer apart from all other planers. No need to use a jig to set the blades. Simply drop in a new blade and you are good to go. There was a woman one day looking out her window watching two men working. One was digging a hole and then the other guy would fill it back in. She watched them do this about 10 times before going outside. She walked up to them and said, I can see that you two are working very hard, but what the hell are you doing? One of them replied, the guy who plants the trees was off sick today. To work on the next knife, simply press down on this tab inside the planer and carefully rotate the cutter head to the next position. Now repeat these steps two more times. With all the blades replaced or rotated, reinstall the hood by lining up the alignment marks with the blower and insert into the housing. Rotate the hood down until it is seated over the blades. Install the center red bolt first and then the two outer bolts. Finally, place the lid back on the planer and tighten the four screws. As a bonus, whenever I replace or rotate the blades on the DeWalt, I like to take the extra time to give the planer a quick tune-up. This is really easy and all you need to do is give the feed rollers a wipe down with some mineral spirits and then do the same for the bed. With the bed cleaned off, apply some paste wax and buff it with a shop rag so that it is polished and super slick. This is going to make the planer much more efficient since the wood will slide smoothly over the bed. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe. And until next time, get out there and make something awesome.